Good morning, boys and girls. It's Miss Kathy here. It's um, Tuesday, September 22nd, 2020. And today's color is green. Yep. I am by myself again today, so I have to run the camera and try to teach at the same time, and it's a little tricky. And if you'll notice, in my background, it's a little different today because I needed the table in our preschool so that we can talk about the color green. That's right. So, um, so it's gonna look a little different behind me, and I'm, as I said, I'm by myself. Uh, no cameraman today and no Miss Jen again, but that's okay. We're gonna learn about the color green. So would you fold your hands, please, and bow your heads and sing with me? Go with us today as we work and play. Help us to be kind and good and do the things we should. Hello, hello, and how are you? Hello, hello, I'm glad to see you. All righty, I am really glad to see you today, and I love talking about the color green. Green is a favorite color of mine. Not my most favorite color. What color is that? Red, that's right. But green comes in next, I think. Alrighty. Well, last week we talked about our primary colors. What were they? Red, blue, and yellow. This week we're talking about our secondary colors. Green, orange, and purple. Today is green. So, we're going to start right off the bat. Can anyone tell me what two colors do we mix to make green? We talked about it yesterday. I had a shirt on yesterday with the colors. If you said blue and yellow, you're right. So I want to show you a couple different things on how we're going to make green, and it's pretty cool. All righty. Well, the first thing I have is I have some paint here. I have my blue paint, and I have my yellow paint, and I'm going to mix them together, but not like this. And we're going to see if it makes that green. So the first thing we're going to do is, and you can do this at home if you have paint, if you have blue and yellow paint, is I'm going to take a plastic bag, okay, and I'm going to open up my blue paint, and I'm going to pour some into my plastic bag. So it's in my bag. There's not a lot. don't need a lot. And then I'm going to open up my yellow. Now we have found that there's all kinds of different kinds of yellow, and sometimes they work really well, and sometimes they don't work well. I'm hoping this is one of the good ones since I don't have Miss Jen here to help me. So I'm going to pour some yellow into my bag, same bag, a little bit of yellow. Now we're going to see what we're going to come up with. First thing you have to do after you pour the two colors into your bag is you close your bag so it does not come out. So I'm going to zip it right up. Now I'm going to take my colors and watch I'm going to smoosh my bag together. And what is happening? Let me get up closer so you can see. What do you think is happening? Is it turning green? Yes, it is. It's turning green. It's a dark green, but it's still turning green. I hope you can see this. Yep, there it is. Look at that. We made that green. Yes, we did. We took the blue and the yellow and we made green. Isn't that cool? It is. Now we're gonna do it again. This time, we're gonna do it on our board. Let me slide my board over here so that you can see it. I have to adjust the camera. Give me a second. All right, and let me back it out a little bit. Okay, now we're gonna show, Sorry. We're going to show you on the board now. I put a big piece of poster board on my board so you can see it. And I have my paintbrush. And I have my yellow paint and my blue paint. So what I'm going to do this time is I'm going to put a little bit of the yellow on a paper plate. And I'm going to put a little bit of blue. And I'm not going to mix them on the paper plate. I'm going to put them so that they're both on the paper plate. But now I'm going to do this. I'm going to take my paintbrush and put it in the yellow. And I'm going to put it on my board up here. I hope you can see that. All right. And I'll put a little bit more. And then what color should I add to it, boys and girls? The blue. 
Let's see what happens. So I'm going to take that, go back and forth right over top of the yellow. And it's starting to turn green. Can you tell? Yes, it is. Now, there's different shades of green and different shades of other colors. So if you want it a little lighter, you add more yellow to it. If you want it to look a little darker green, you add some more blue to it. But as you can see, I made green. Yep. So I could actually make some, and it was yellow, but it's all been mixed now. I'm going to make some green grass. There we go, green grass. And let's make a green. That will be the top of my tree. And let's make it a little rounder. Can make it round. All right, add a little blue to it to keep that green in there. All right, now the trunk is usually brown. Now we don't have any brown, so we're gonna take our blue and we're gonna go up and down and make a bluish trunk. That's not too bad, but there we go. We made a tree, a green tree, with yellow and blue. Look at there. And that's what you're going to do today, if you can do that. Make some green. Now, if you know how to make uh, Play-Doh, you can take and make some uh, yellow Play-Doh and blue Play-Doh and mix it together and you'll get green, right? What were some things that were green? Do you remember? We talked about green things. We sang a song. Let me move my camera again. So I'm not bending over all the time. There's our tree. All right, what did we sing about? We sang about Farmer Brown and he had red apples, but he also can have green apples. So would you sing that with me? Farmer Brown had five green apples hanging on a tree. Farmer Brown had five green apples hanging on a tree. When he picked one apple and he ate it greedily, leaving four green apples hanging on a tree. Farmer Brown had four green apples hanging on a tree. Farmer Brown had four green apples hanging on a tree. When he picked one apple and he ate it greedily, leaving three green apples hanging on a tree. Farmer Brown had three green apples hanging on a tree. Farmer Brown had three green apples hanging on a tree. When he picked one apple and he ate it greedily, leaving two green apples hanging on a tree. Farmer Brown had two green apples hanging on a tree. Farmer Brown had two green apples hanging on a tree. When he picked one apple and he ate it greedily, leaving one green apple hanging on a tree. Farmer Brown had one green apple hanging on a tree. Farmer Brown had one green apple hanging on a tree. When he picked one apple and he ate it greedily, leaving no more apples hanging on a tree. Very good. Yesterday we learned Gung Gung went a little green frog. Ready? Get your eyes ready. Gung Gung went the little green frog one day. Gung Gung went the little green frog. Gung Gung went the little green frog one day and his eyes went uh gloom. <laughs> Good. And two little blackbirds. Now that's not green, but I like this one. Ready? Two little blackbirds sitting on a hill. One named Jack and one named Jill. Fly away Jack. Fly away Jill. Come back, Jack. Come back, Jill. Good job. Now, what two colors did we use to make the green? Blue. So we had a blue song. Do you remember it? Three blue pigeons. And just like those black birds, they flew away. Ready? Three blue pigeons sitting on a hill. Oh, where did they sit? Sitting on a wall. Three blue pigeons sitting on a wall. Three blue pigeons sitting on a wall. One flew away. How many's left? Two. 
Two blue pigeons sitting on a wall. Two blue pigeons sitting on a wall. One flew away. How many is left? One. One blue pigeon sitting on a wall. One blue pigeon sitting on a wall. He flew away. How many is left? No. None. No blue pigeons sitting on a wall. No blue pigeons sitting on a wall. Oh, but here comes how many? One. One blue pigeon sitting on a wall. One blue pigeon sitting on a wall. Here comes his buddy. How many? Two. Two blue pigeons sitting on a wall. Two blue pigeons sitting on a wall. Here comes the last one. Three blue pigeons sitting on a wall. Three blue pigeons sitting on a wall. Very good. So that's the blue song. We mixed blue with yellow to make uh, green. So we have a song about Sally go round the sun because Sally the Sally's son is yellow. So let me fix the camera because I have to stand up for this one because everybody needs to get up off of their sofa. Is this good enough, Miss Kathy? Mm, no, Miss Kathy's not. It's much easier when I have a cameraman. You know that. All right, here we go. And get ready because you have to jump. Sally go round the sun. Sally go round the moon. Sally go round the chimney top every afternoon. Boom! Sally go round the sun. Sally go round the moon. Sally go round the chimney top every afternoon. Boom! Sally go round the sun. Sally go round the moon. Sally go round the chimney top every afternoon. Boom! Good job, guys. Give yourselves a clap. And we shall move you back up here where you can see me again. There's our tree that we made. All righty, well now we're gonna do, let me sit back down. I have something that I have at preschool and I get them out to play with and it is my crayons. And here is my big crayon, it's a big crayon. I don't use it to draw with, but in my crayon, do you think there's things in my crayon? What color do you think they are? If you said green, you're right. All righty. Well, we're gonna take the lid off the crayon and we're gonna see what's in our crayon. Let me shake it. Let me see if you can guess. The first thing I'm going to pull out, oh, this is something we eat and it's crunchy and sometimes mommies and daddies will put um, peanut butter on it. Do you know what it is? Celery, yep, celery. Celery, I like celery. This is not real celery, but I like celery. Let's shake it up. Let's see what's next in our green crayon. And I'm gonna pull something out of there. It's all stuck together though. Oh, no wonder it's stuck together. It is a plant. Do you know what this is called? It's called a green, I can't even get it apart because it's somebody stuck it together last year like this. It's a green vine. Do you have green vines at your house? Ivy is a vine. I have ivy at my house. Green vine. Yep, grape vines are green sometimes and they turn brown, but a green vine. Yeah, very good. All right, let's shake it. See what else is in here? See if you can guess. Oh, the next thing we just sang about and it says ribbit, ribbit. You're right, it's a little green frog. Ribbit, ribbit. Okay, shake it, shake it, shake it. What else is in here? Oh, the boys and girls are gonna, oh, these, I like to eat these. Uh, they put them on burgers, especially when you go to McDonald's or Wendy's, I take them off and eat them. Do you know what they are? Pickles, they're pickles, pickles are green. I love pickles, these are not real ones, but I love pickles. Mm -hmm. It's making me hungry, celery. And pickles. What else is in here? Oh, here comes, oh, here comes something else. Oh, these are all over the place right now. They are an insect and they hop. Grasshopper, yeah. And when I was out hiking on my vacation here, they were all over the place hopping. When I mow, they hop. They are good insects, but they do hop a lot. 
All right, I think there might be two more in the, in the green can. Oh, these I like to eat too. See, I'm getting hungry. These are grapes. These are green grapes. What other color can grapes be? Red, that's right. They can be in purple. Last thing, let's see if you can guess what it is. This is something that we see at Christmas and we bring them into our houses and we decorate them. Are you yelling out a Christmas tree? This is a little bitty one, little bitty Christmas tree. Yep. Very good, boys and girls. That's the end of my crayon uh, container. You did a great job on that. That was excellent. All righty. So we'll put the lid back on it so we don't lose it. And then when you come to preschool, it'll be one of the toys that I get out and you get to play with it. All right, we'll stick it over there on that table. And I have two more things to do here. Let me flip around. I have a little poem. <clears throat> I'm going to have to take our tree down because I think I need the, this. And I have a little poem about something that's green and they can be all kinds of colors. But this one is green. And do you know what this is? It's a monster. Yep. And I'm going to put him on our board right up here. All right, and there he is. And he has some buddies with him. There we go. You know what, I need to grab some Tiki Tac. Remember what Tiki Tac is, boys and girls who have been here before? It's the stuff that Miss Kathy uses to stick things with. If you haven't been to preschool before, you'll find out. It's, this is what Tiki Tac is. And it's only for Miss Kathy or Miss Jen to touch uh, because I need it. So we're gonna put these green monsters up on our board and we're going to count how many green monsters there are. Oh, he fell down. He doesn't want to be on the board, does he? Nope. All right, we'll put him up there. Maybe he wants to be down here. There we go. Okay. All right, you ready? Help me count. Here we go. One, two, three, four, Five. Five cuddly monsters walking down the street. The first one said, I have big feet. The second one said, those feet do smell. The third one said, yours do as well. The fourth one said, please do not fight. And the fifth one said, yes, be polite. So the five little monsters quarreled no more and they all walked away with a great big roar. Everybody roar, roar. Okay, try to do it with me, okay? Are you ready? Here we go. Five cuddly monsters walking down the street. The first one said, I have big feet. The second one said, those feet do smell. The third one said, yours do as well. The fourth one said, please do not fight. The fifth one said, yes, be polite. So the five little monsters quarreled no more and they all walked away with a great big roar. Well, I hope you didn't scare mommy. Thank you for doing that with me. All righty, we have time for a story and we will be done again. And our days are going by so fast, right? I don't have a green story. I have a story though about White Rabbit and White Rabbit does make green in this story. So let's see what she does, ready? Open, shut them, open, shut them, give them a little clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them, put them in your lap. Let's move the monsters over that way a little bit. Here we go. White Rabbit's Color Book by Alan Baker. One day, White Rabbit found three big tubs of paint, red, yellow, and blue. Oh, we know what she's gonna do. Oh, sunshine yellow. Oh, she thought lovely. And a quick dip and yellow rabbit. Bright as the sun. Now what about red, thought Rabbit. Oh, this is the color we're gonna talk about tomorrow. What color do you think she's gonna make? Let's see. Oh, what's this? Orange Rabbit? 
Look, red and yellow together make orange. Oh, that's the color for tomorrow. You must wear orange tomorrow. Red and yellow. <gasps> Time for a wash, thought Rabbit. Oh, she's going to wash it all off. Red on its own this time. Splash! Right into the red she went. Red rabbit. Sizzling hot red. How cool blue looks though, saw, thought rabbit. Well now she's going to make the color we're going to do on Thursday. What color do you think that one is? Let's see. There she is. She's sitting in the blue pot and she's red and she turns into... <gasps> What's this? Purple rabbit? Look, red and blue together make purple. I'm a very important royal purple rabbit. Oh, so that will be Thursday's color, purple. Princess purple rabbit in the shower. Oh, let's do blue, thought rabbit. Oh, blue rabbit, icy cold blue, brr. How warm does yellow look, thought rabbit. Oh, you know what color she's gonna turn. What color, yell it out. Green! What's this green rabbit? Look, blue and yellow together make green. Oh dear, no more water. Uh-oh. And all that's left is a little red paint. Well now what would happen, thought Rabbit, if she mixes red, blue, and yellow together? She turns into, oh, one of our colors. Brown, hooray brown rabbit, lovely warm brown. Blue, yellow, and red together make brown. And brown's just right for me, a rabbit. I hope you enjoyed that story and I hope you remember that tomorrow you need to wear orange. And we're gonna talk about and show how we're gonna mix those colors tomorrow. Alrighty, well, another day has gone by, so we're gonna have a prayer and then you're gonna go on your way and do some fun things today. And you can make some green pictures to show me what you did. I also try to post some things on there for some art projects. And don't forget to practice writing your lines. All right. And we will talk to you tomorrow. Fold your hands, please. Bow your heads. Dear Lord, thank you for this day and the color green, which is a wonderful, wonderful color. And be with us always, Lord. Amen. Oh, it's time to say goodbye to our friends. Oh, it's time to say goodbye to our friends. Oh, it's time to say goodbye, so just smile and wink your eye. Oh, it's time to say goodbye to our friends. Bye-bye, <laughs> boys and girls. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.